Okay, so when we're talking about slide technique, which is moving the, the trombone slide, like I said, I'm not gonna get too nitty gritty about what our hands are doing, but we need to think about this. So the idea is moving from like our biggest joint to our smallest joint. So the idea of like the shoulder almost moves first, right? Which when we're playing trombone, we're really not gonna move our shoulder too much. Try it out. What happens when you move your shoulder? What's happening? I don't know. Your body's moving, yeah. right? So we don't want that to happen. We will use a lot of elbow, so just only move your elbow. Okay. Which, this is why the death grip isn't good for us. Because if we're, like yep, if we're using um, a death grip, like a fist, all we get to move is our elbow. But there's more that we can move. Okay, so beyond moving our elbow, what's the next thing we can use? Think about it, what's this? Your wrist. Yeah, so you can start using your wrist. Okay, so a little bit of shoulder, elbow, wrist. And then there's one more element. What do we think it is? Fingers. fingers. Your fingers. Yeah, so especially when you get into faster playing in jazz music, you're going to use your fingers a lot. I use them all the time. And also, I have short arms, which I'm sure you guys too. No. How many of us can reach out to seventh position with no troubles? What? I can. So I, when I go out to seventh, I only use my fingers. I do not, I can't use my wrist. That's, I, I have to just like throw the slide all the way out there. Don't throw Sometimes it off. Sometimes if I go fast enough, I can go all the way to eighth position. Eighth position? Yeah. I mean, I that's eight. off the trombone. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But you guys get the idea. So think of, let me see how you're doing your slide one more time with that grip of yours. So we want to think of, here, hold your trombone in playing position. See, with putting, see how you're putting the weight here? You're limiting the absolute use of your wrist. So, start to experiment. I'm not too picky about all this right now, but start to experiment having your wrist away from the slide with the idea that we have to use that wrist. Okay? If our wrist is underneath our slide the way you had it, you're not going to be able to use your wrist to help you play fast, right? Right? So you gotta, eventually, you're gonna need that wrist. You're gonna need those fingers, okay? So start to keep that in mind now, alright? So ease up on the death grip a little bit. <laughs> so that's the idea, going out to... Thank you. 